These are the top 25 rookies over the last 25 years in the NBA in terms of points per game in their first season. As you can see, Blake Griffin and Zion Williamson had the two highest scoring rookie seasons of the last 25 years, although it's worth pointing out, Zion only played in 24 games in his rookie season, and Blake Griffin was a redshirt rookie, missing his first year in the league due to injury. But after them, you've got Luka Doncic's rookie season, and then two guys from the 2003 draft, Carmelo Anthony and LeBron James, and then you've got Victor Wimbanyama this season in sixth. Now a lot of these guys went on to make an all-star team, as you can see here in yellow. In fact, other than the three young guys, Wimbenyama and the two guys down here from the 2021 draft, Cade Cunningham and Jalen Green, only three other guys from this list didn't make an all-star team in their career. Tyreek Evans, OJ Mayo, and Jaleel Okafor. And then a lot of these guys were also named Rookie of the Year. That's these guys in pink. You can see how Tyreek Evans did win Rookie of the Year despite never making an all-star team in his career. And then on the other hand, the guys still in yellow didn't win Rookie of the Year but did go on to make an all-star team. Okay, but points per game only tells part of the story. So now let's bring in some of the other box score stats and see how that changes things. So here are the top 25 rookies from the last 25 seasons in the other box score stats, rebounds, assists, steals, and blocks. As you can see, we have a new number one, Ben Simmons. His rookie season stats of eight rebounds, eight assists, and nearly two steals and a block are the best of any rookie in the last quarter century. Although it's worth pointing out that, like Blake Griffin, Simmons missed his first NBA season due to injury. But following Simmons, we've got two guys from the last list, Victor Wimbanyama and the aforementioned Blake Griffin. Wimby's three and a half blocks really boost him up this list. And then they're followed by two more guys who weren't on the previous list, Lonzo Ball and Josh Giddy, and then it's Luka Doncic again. Okay, so these players highlighted in gray are all of the repeats from the points per game list. And so now, just considering the new players on the list, let's see who made an all-star game in yellow. As you can see, it's just Ben Simmons, John Wall, Chris Paul, LaMelo Ball, and Dwight Howard. And then finally, in pink, we have the Rookie of the Year winners, again, excluding the players from the previous list. And so it's just, again, Ben Simmons and Chris Paul, and then Michael Carter-Williams and Emeka Okafor as well. Okay, so who do you think was the best rookie of the last 25 years? How much stock do you think we should put into a player's rookie season? And which other players had overrated or underrated rookie seasons? Let me know in the comments.